I'm going to try to make this fast. I picked up this metal protectant called shark hide. Well, I opened it up and uh, from my many years of painting experience with automotive paints, I realized it was a lacquer clear type substance and not an oil type substance, which I thought it was. So I went ahead and I coated my stainless steel sink inside. Seemed pretty good. Um, it doesn't remove scratches, so don't expect that. Here it is. I went ahead and poured some water on it, and this is the first time. You see it dissipates pretty quick, and the bad part, after I wipe it down, it gets worse. So it's more of a paint. I went ahead and coated this piece of aluminum. Top half covered, bottom half not. It does create a haziness in the part that you're coating. And it is a wipe on type process. So, and you definitely want to make sure that your surface has been cleaned with lacquer thinner, uh, maybe even acetone on top of that, just to make sure everything is out of it. Am I happy with it? Well, here I am on a polished trailer, and this is what I expect. So, I'll back up, you can see my hand, that's a reflection. So, that's what I expect out of my polished aluminum. I went ahead and I put it on a panel on the back of my trailer. So here you'll see the panel that I did and there's the can next to it. Um, I did get some streaking in there. So I went ahead and I stripped this thing down a couple times and redid it in different fashions. One with a diaper, like they recommend, and a couple others, uh, some microfiber. I still get some streaking, so not something I would be happy with on a super highly polished item like my trailer or maybe something else you may be doing. As far as oxidation goes, it may be beneficial in the long run, but the choice is yours.